What's up, everyone? Happy Tuesday. We are down at the Woodmere Docks. And the sun is rising behind the clouds. Super pretty out here, even without the sun. Even without the sun, it's pretty. It's pretty, pretty. Where's everybody? Tuesday morning. About 65 degrees here on Long Island, New York. And I uh, got a little overcast skies. There was a little drizzle before. And uh, luckily it's not pouring. So where's everybody this morning? Let's go. All right, let's get on with some messaging here. There we go. There's everybody coming on. Good morning. Good morning. So Tuesday morning, we ride at dawn, day 127. Of 365 and uh, we're getting it done getting it done all right so Tuesday message of the day are you coming up short are you coming up short in your life um, it seems like a lot of us feel like we're coming up short in our life we work hard working hard and still feel like we're coming up short and the problem with that is we are not um, relying on God, and we're not saying our prayers, and we're not living in the light. Um, ask yourself, if you're coming up short, are you doing the right thing every day? Are you saying your prayers? Are you having faith in God? Um, listen to little Joel this morning, and he says we need to meditate on the idea that all is well. Just keep repeating that in your mind, all is well. No matter what happens in your life, all is well. God is in control. The bad things in our life are there to teach us a lesson, and we need to learn from that. We've talked about this before. But if you keep repeating to yourself, all is well, and you have faith that God has a plan, and you just keep living your life right, and you keep helping those around you, and you keep spreading the love, your time will come. Your roadmap of life is planned out for you, and you don't know it. And the more you try and force it, you're going to run yourself off the road. So just think to yourself, all is well. Have peace and all is well. And do the right thing every day. The Bible verse this morning talked about um, confessing our sins and being vulnerable among God's people. It's important. Um, the people around me, that um, they get real, they get raw, they get vulnerable explain where they are in life, and open up. It helps them. It helps us. It helps us understand. Um, with Facebook being down yesterday, I think everyone thought the world was going to end. And you know what? It didn't. But it did teach us some lessons. The fake Facebook world, it's all unicorns and rainbows. Um, very few people are vulnerable. Very few people are sharing what's really going on in their life. Um, not everyone is winning all the time and even those that are winning all the time are fighting battles behind the scenes that we don't know about you know reality shows are scripted on tv you know it's uh it's not all unicorns and rainbows so the message is to get vulnerable with the people around you confess your sins to the people around you love the people around you and have faith in god and know that all is well so that's your message of the day don't come up short anymore. Let's uh, let's live your life to the fullest. Have faith. Say your prayers. Help out your fellow man and woman. Lean on people and let them lean on you. We're all in this together. Fire starts fire. So with that, let's jump on prayers. All right. In the name of Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to have faith in you. Help us to say our prayers every day and help us to spread your love. Um, prayers are more than just words. Prayers are how you act each day in life. Prayers are how you 
reach out and help people in your life. Uh, pick people up when they're down. Uh, go out of your way to talk to people. Go out of your way to love people. Um, we're all in this world together. And fire starts fire. So, God, please help us to stay in faith and, and know that all is well. Know that you have a plan. And uh, do our best every day. Live the life to the fullest. So, amen. Um, Tuesday edition. We ride at dawn 127. Quiet today out there in my following world. I don't know if Facebook's still messed up, but hopefully you'll see the repeat message. Going to get on my ride. Got a busy day today. Uh, working on a new Malvern listing. See if that happens. We might have a nice house in Malvern for uh, our friends out there working on a new Rockaway listing. Um, I have some new inventory coming in, hopefully, for you guys. And uh, we'll make some things happen. So, all right. God bless everyone. If I can help you in anything in your life, real estate, riding your bike, fitness, getting your life together, losing some weight, down 70 pounds or so-ish, something like that. Um, it's a decision you got to make in your life. I can help you with that. I'm here for your support. I can be your accountability partner. Again, I can help you with your business and real estate and whatever you need in life. Lean on me. I'm here for you. I love to help people. So have a great day. God bless. Check out the Facebook page. We write at dawn. 365, which is a Facebook group, and uh, we share some uh, inspirational stuff in there, so keep your day going. Remember, all day long, repeat it, all is well, and it will be well. God bless.